Hey, this is Molly Gold, and I'm the president and founder of Gum on Mink. And today, I'm sharing with you your organized road trip. Do you fight with your partner about how to pack the car? Even in my house, and yes, I'm a home organization specialist. <laughs> my husband's determined that he can pack a better car than me. So I'm really excited because for this trip, I get to pack the car because Honda is sponsoring our ride. So let me show you three things that really make a difference to keep your family comfortable and your car organized while you're on the road. It all starts in the cargo area. That's why I'm sitting back here. And I want you to see how far down my arm goes. Honda was the inventor of the magic seat and deep well. And I'm telling you what, this is a huge amount of cargo space. We've got every suitcase here. That means that nobody's gonna have any sort of territory issues in those rows, and I'm loving it. Wanna make sure you remember that if you're on a long car trip like we are, and you're gonna stop for one overnight stay, make sure to have an overnight bag with everyone's pajamas, everyone's outfits for the next day, and a toiletries bag so that you don't have to pack on all of this. You only have to take this inside with you. Follow me to the next stop. Okay, now that you've secured your cargo, it's time to secure your people. And by this I mean, just keep them happy, whatever it takes to keep them happy. And no, I don't mean a bunch of sugar. Entertain your children. Have them work with you to create a go bag of things that they might want to do in the car. We're talking crayons, coloring books, PSP, their own iPod, whatever it is right in there. And then, this is the magic tool. Right here is the key to your success. Yes, we're talking media. Get a small case like this, borrow one from a friend, and put every DVD or CD that you have inside here. That way you won't have cases all over the car, and you'll give them a lot of independence because they can choose no matter what row they're sitting in, which movie they'd like to watch. And yes, I'm all about using an in-car movie system. If you don't have one, borrow one, a portable one. But the great thing about a Honda Odyssey is, check it out. Not only do they have one, it's the mother load. It's a dual screen, which means you can put two DVDs in at the same time and watch two movies at the same time. Or you can just watch one movie at one time, and there's also an outlet for HDMI cables out back. You can play your gaming system right here. It's the bomb. Shouldn't have any reason to have people be unhappy with media options like that. One more tip coming your way. Okay, so my final tip for you to have a well-organized road trip is all about food. When you're in the front row, you're gonna be hearing people talking about, I'm hungry, I need to go to the bathroom. You've got a job as the driver, and your passenger has a job too to keep everybody happy and keep you on the road. So a couple of quick tips about how you can manage your food. Please make sure to pack snacks for people, waters, and make sure that it's everything white. How am I gonna do that in my Honda Odyssey? check it out. They have this awesome thing called the cool box right here. All you have to do is open that up. It's an in-car cooler. So you can have soda, fruit that needs to be cooled, or water right at your dispense if you're the driver and also easy to just store in there and hand back to people. The other thing, you notice this right here, this little hook is all about the trash bag. When you're gonna be providing people with snacks in the car for a long 10 hour road trip, you need something to do with the trash in between stops for gas. So check this out. You can just hook it on here. It really doesn't involve anybody's leg space. You can put everything in there and when it's time to go, you just take that off and you're on your way. And then finally, to avoid the cooler, which I love that you can do in this car, check out how much cargo space is in here. Here is where, yes, every road trip needs some red vines. I can keep those, but I can also keep wet ones to hand out to people, a wet sack in case we get something messy going on, and then any manner of snacks. Notice that they're individually packaged. It's your key to controlling not only the mess in the car, but also the amount of food that people eat. I hope that this helps you think about how you can pack your car up. Remember, your goal is to keep them happy so that you can go the distance. I hope you have a well-organized road trip, and we'd love to thank Honda for being the sponsor of ours.